Hi students, coming to the next topic in the subject database management system is database users and the administrators. So in the previous video when I am explaining about the database management system structure, there we had seen database users. So those are different users that are present in the here. So this is a database management structure. Here you have seen different users. These are the database users native users, application programmers, sophisticated users and database administrators. So let us see who are the database users. So the database users are native user, next application programmer, and sophisticated user and specialized sorry three four specialized user sorry it's not writing so let me write specialized user and next is online user. So these are the uh, five users. You call it as a database user. Means the these people are accessing the database. Now let us see one by one. So who are native users? Native users. So native users are those who need not be aware of aware of the presence of database system so they don't know uh, about the presence of database system they are just accessing the uh, application whatever they are using that so they need not be aware of the presence of the database system so in the structure i had said native users are nothing but the sellers and the agents so they will interact with the database only with the help of the application interface so they are not aware of the presence of the database systems okay and these are the you can also call these are end users of database who work through menu driven applications only with the application whatever they are seeing on the screen just with the application they are interacting with the database so they don't know what type of database system is present inside those you call it as a native users now coming to the next next is the application programmer so application programmer is a person who develops the application he can interact with the database so the application programmer or responsible For developing application programs, so he is the main responsible for developing the application programs or user interfaces. User interface. So here the application program will be written. So always the application program, whatever it is, the different application programs if you are taken, those will be written will be written in high level language so examples are c c plus plus java those are all written in the high level language by the programmer so those you call it as application programs now the next is the sophisticated user the third one is who you call it as a sophisticated user the user who interacting with the database only with the queries those are the sophisticated users so let me write sophisticated users or interact interact with the system without writing programs without writing the programs they are not writing the programs to interact with the database they request only with the help of the query they request in query language 
so they won't write the program to interact with the database and the next fourth one fourth one is a specialized user So, specialized user means who writes, who writes specialized database applications that do not fit, they, they won't fit, that do not fit into fractional database. So, those you call it as a specialized user that do not fit into fractional database processing framework so those you call it as a specialized user and the next one is the online user the last one database user is the online user so here the online users who may communicate with database directly through online so the person who communicate with database directly through online those you call it as an online user so these are the different users that are present in the database means uh, they are accessing the database uh, so those are called as database users, native users, application programmers, sophisticated users, specialized users and the online users. Now let us see what is a database administrator, who you call it as a database administrator. So actually the database administrator is, is just simple, he is a person. It is a person or a group of in charge. He may the database administrator may be a person or a group of in charge for implementing database system in the organization. Implementing database system in an organization. So within an organization. So here the database administrator has all privileges he is having all uh, permissions he he is the person who give the permissions to the users to access the database so here he is having all the privileges allowed by the database management system and can assign or remove he can assign or remove the privileges from the users so everything will be uh, done by this administrator itself means he is the person he is a group of in charge or, or he who implementing the database system and he is a person who maintains the privileges means he is allowing the persons to access the database management system and he is he can assign or remove the privileges from the users so he can give the permission and he can remove the permissions to interact with the database system so that that you call it as a database administrator the dba thank you